What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, J-Main, back checking in with the people. And hold up. Is that... Is this two videos on a day? Am I actually dropping consistent content? Don't say that too loud. <laughs> I might not drop another video for weeks. <laughs> anyway, see, I wasn't going to do a video about this because I'm like, there's no reason for me to really do a video. Everybody seems to be upset about this. Everybody seems to be on Nintendo's ass about this. No. Unfortunately... No matter what happens in life, you will always have apologists and people who will damage control bullshit. Now, back when the Switch was originally launched, Nintendo talked about a mobile app for communicating with friends. Now, originally, I had a problem with that because I'm like, why would I go ahead and pay for your online service to use a mobile app just to talk to my friends when I can already do that on my mobile apps for free? Let alone... This is supposed to be a next generation console and we can't communicate on the console. We have to use an outside source just to talk with friends and then you're putting it behind a paywall. No, you got Discord, you got Skype, you got Google Hangouts, you got all these other outlets to communicate with friends. If you even want to use a mobile app, which shouldn't even be the case, my PlayStation Vita which came out years ago, can communicate with friends on my friends list. Voice chat, whatever, uh, messages, regular messages, all that type of stuff. And you're telling me in 2017, your device cannot communicate with friends on the actual hardware itself? I have to use a mobile app? It's blasphemous. So now it comes out that Hori has designed a special headset to coincide with this mobile app that Nintendo is supposed to be coming out with. And this thing looks ridiculous. You have the headset itself connected to a splitter, which has two wires going from the splitter, one going into the phone, one going into the switch. Now I'm assuming the one going into the switch is for game audio and the one going to the phone is for voice chat. This thing looks ridiculous. It looks terrible. It looks like, why? Why, how hard is it to be able to plug a headset into a headphone jack and be able to communicate? How hard is that? We got controllers doing that. You telling me a $300 hardware device can't do that? What, what is going on there? That, that, that makes no sense. And you got people damage controlling this. Talking about, oh, it's fine. It's fine. I've been doing this on my 3DS. I don't give a damn what you've been doing on your 3DS. This is 2017. This is the problem. People want to apologize for this stuff when it's an issue. And then Nintendo's going to want to charge for stuff like this. And they expect people like, I read a tweet. Like, if you want Nintendo to really feel the pressure, then don't support their online service. And I 100% agree with that. We can't sit up here and get mad on social media and go ahead and subscribe to the service. Because that's not going to show them anything. That's going to be like, all right, they're fine with it. They talk a, a good game. But they ain't backing it up. So, yeah. I mean, we got, definitely got to wait to see if this is official. You know, Hori is a third-party company. And this could just be their way of getting a headset out for Splatoon 2's launch. But until then, like, what other evidence shows that Nintendo is actually going to make uh, a native voice chat system on the device? They've already been promoting this mobile app. They already We already see these third-party headsets. The, the system already doesn't have communication with friends. You can't talk with friends. You can't message with friends. Nothing is there. So you're telling me we might have to wait for the mobile app or the online service to be behind a paywall to get stuff like that? That's ridiculous. And it's not acceptable. So, like, we got to vote with our wallets. Like, I'm not, I'm not subscribing to this service if that's the case. I will be fine with not playing online. That's it. It is what it is. I got to stand behind my my words. As simple as that. So, I don't know. Nintendo needs to come out and rectify this. If that's the case, then I know where my wallet stands, and I'm not supporting that bullshit. And that's that. But let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about this. And if you are okay with this, you're getting blocked. That's I'm I'm not dealing with that. I'm not dealing with bullshit, man. Forget that. Hell no. I'll catch y'all in my next video. Peace.